Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me today for another video. In this video, we're going to be looking at the Power Talkie by iWox. Now, this isn't a walkie-talkie. It's not really a two-way radio. Well, it is a two-way radio, but all become clear as we get into the video. So, the Power Talkie is basically a portable device that enables two or more smartphones to stay connected and send things like text messages, locations and voice messages to each other, either individual to individual or within a group. Now, this is achieved by providing a mesh network for emergency communications when you're out of reach of data networks and Wi-Fi. Now, the device uses an encryption algorithm and there's no need to change channels by yourself um, because it has what's called channel synchronization, which means the devices talk to each other and make sure they're on the same frequency. And they operate within the US and EU license-free bands. So they're ideal for emergency communications, uh, camping, outdoor activities, and as a backup in case you find yourself out of range of data networks and Wi-Fi networks. So devices like this that create a mesh network have quite a lot of benefits. They are what is known as genuine off-grid communications, so they don't require a mobile data network, Wi-Fi, or anything like that. You can share your location and offline maps, and they have up to a four mile range. Now, we'll take this loosely. Depending on the, tr on the terrain, this could be a hell of a lot more, um, especially in an open area. And obviously, in built up areas, the range is limited considerably. They also act as a 6,000 mAh power bank, so it'll charge things like phones, torches, and stuff like that. I actually used this to power my sat nav the other day, and they'll charge two iPhone Xs fully. They're 100% waterproof and submersible, and there's no monthly fees or subscription. They have an SOS function, so an SOS button on the side. Uh, the battery life will last for seven days in standby, and they have a really rugged design. They're actually shockproof and dustproof as well as waterproof. And they use their own proprietary app, so there's no, so there's no other subscription services, no other apps, websites, anything like that. They just have their own Power Talkie app, which we'll come to further into the video. And you'll need to download this and register for free before you actually go out there into the field. So they have an output power of 2 watts and they operate in the USA on 462.550 to 462.725 megahertz. And in the UK on 446.00625 to 446.09375. So basically PMR446. Now, they do send voice messages, but they send these over data, so they are encrypted. And they have an FCC ID, the CE and ROHS compliant as well. So if we have a look in the pack, it's very simple. You get two of these devices. You get two UHF antennas, two USB power leads that can be used to either charge the devices themselves, or you can connect other USB devices uh, to the um, power talkie to charge them. You get a manual a card which shows you where to download the apps and this really nice carry case. It comes in a really nice package that you can just grab and go, put straight into the back of your car, into a rucksack and go straight out into the field and use them. Okay, so you can see I've got two mobile phones here. They're both iPhones and they are in flight mode with only Bluetooth enabled. That's the only thing you need to operate these devices. So we're going to simulate a um, grid down situation. So no um, Wi-Fi networks, no cellular networks. And if you download the um, Power Talkie app from the Google Play Store or the Android App Store, you just need to install that and register for free so you can um, put your email address and password in. Or if you like, you can actually log in as a guest so you don't need to um, register at all. So you can see I've logged in as a guest there. My user is 9811020. And if we click on device pairing, and just click on the screen to refresh, you can see both of the devices actually come up in front of me there. So on the back, we're looking at the number that ends in 043, and that is the device on the bottom there that we're going to connect to, and it's as simple as that. And on the second smartphone, same conditions, we're going to um, go into the app, we're going to log in as a guest, um, and I haven't used it on this phone, so there's some notifications there. And you can see we're logged in with a username of 9868710. And if we click on refresh there, you can see the remaining device comes up. And we click on that and connect. So now both phones are connected to each PT01 device. So what we're going to do, we're going to click on contacts. And I'm going to click on the other user there. Now it's telling me that there's no network, but you don't need a network. And we're going to click on send message 
I'm just going to type in a message. And you can see that sent. Now, that message wasn't sent over cellular. It's being sent via Bluetooth to the power talking device. And they are talking to each other via data mode over 446. So how cool is that? And you can see that's how we can um, send voice messages as well. We just click on the keyboard at the bottom and a push to talk button comes up and that will send voice clips. Testing one, two, testing one, two, one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Now sometimes there's a little bit of delay because you have to remember these are these are talking over Bluetooth um, and then via 446 so it's not as quick as 4G um, but it definitely works and works really well. So if we click on the logo again at the bottom you can see we actually have a PTT button now these actually send live clips to each other and um, it can be sometimes a little bit um, laggy depending on the Bluetooth connection but what we're going to do is we're going to save this for another video and we'll do this out in the field. Okay guys, so that's part one, just a quick overview of the iWox Power Talkie. I'm sure you'll agree, it's a really impressive system, a really impressive bit of kit. Now, other companies have released mesh networks, the technology that I'm showing you here isn't new, uh, but these devices are relatively new, and I think they've definitely got um, a lot of potential and a lot of uses, especially in emergency situations. Um, you have to look around the world now where we've got fires raging Australia, and um, there's floods in all sorts of countries, um, you know, if we have snow, things like that, and networks happen to be down, then you've got a backup system there to connect smartphones. And let's face it, this day and age, a lot of younger people and a lot of people who aren't interested in radio can use a smartphone a lot better than they could use a two-way radio, so it definitely has its advantages. So what we're going to do in the next video, we're going to go out into the field and we're going to do some tests using the PTT function on these. Um, but I just wanted to give you a quick overview in this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. Um, let me know what you think in the box below. If you have any comments, suggestions or questions, then drop them in there. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, then make sure you hit the subscribe button. And as always, links are in the description. And all that's left to say is 7-3. Thanks very much for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.